Hello guys, yeah, my name is Joanne Dundubisi, your software testing instructor. Yes, guys, I'm not here to teach software testing, but I want to let you know that if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, guys, you're really missing out, seriously. That course is a nice course for you to learn. So I would like you to subscribe to my YouTube channel because I have a lot of things I'm going to teach you on that course. I'll be teaching you what software is. Software, let me just give you like a little introduction because I'm not here to do software test. I have a, little, a different thing actually that I want to do. Software test, software is defined as a collection of instruction and data that are used to perform a specific task in the computer. Software tells the computer on how to work and how to function. But we all know that we have different kind of software and the world is filled with different kind of software and as a human being uh, we use software and this has become a very crucial part in our life you can see software in the apps of your phone the medical machinery in the hospital the banking app and so on examples of software which are known as the internet browser google chrome firefox operating system the movie uh, player vlc yeah and so on but here, and we all know that software testing is very, very important and necessary. Yes, because software bugs are very dangerous. They are dangerous to our life. It can damage company reputation. It can cause time wastage. It can cause loss of life. Yes, loss of life. Very, this one is very important. For example, the aeroplanes Ethiopia airlines are crashed and the planes have been crashed in, crashing sorry you know people die 157 people that lost their life in Ethiopia airline that crashed in 2019 so my dear people my dear lovely people depending any part of the world you are I want you to join me on my YouTube channel you will learn a lot about this course and I would like you to enroll on this course it's a very nice course that you will learn you can be an instructor you can be on your own you can learn mobile testing different kind of testing that is that they have so please i would like you to subscribe subscribe to my youtube channel joando and bc and life tech giant to youtube either subscribe to joando and bc where i have different kind of things that i do then the other one is life tech giant where i have everything that has to do with electronics subscribe to my youtube channel and hit the button so that each time i release new videos you will be the first person to get it today here as i am now i'm not going to be teaching software testing because that one is a course on its own i'm here to teach you how to make a very lovely soup wonderful soup because i am from africa in africa we did on soup most especially our we are the the regional parts where they call igbo land they have what they like what they call swallow Swallow, so to, they call it fufu or gari. So here today, I'm here to prepare what they call ukfe ulugu, the talif soup. And I wish you guys will enjoy this video. Join me while I show you how to cook ukfe ulugu, ukfe ulugu. Thank you. Yes, here I have my meat, which is um shaki. Yes, I think this one is. This is shaki and uh, toki. Yes, this is what we can get from United Kingdom. You know, in Africa we use our they use red meat, but I mean I prefer even they have red meat here, but I prefer this toki and uh, go shaki. Then I have here is my tilapia. Is it tilapia fish? Yeah, tilapia fish. This is fresh one. I'm supposed to use dry one. But I don't think I'll be able to do that now due to time. I was supposed to review it. And here is my um what is it called? Prong. This is my prong. I was supposed to use oh, the sun is too much here. I was supposed to use um what is it called? Dry crayfish. But I decided to use because my husband doesn't like um he doesn't like um dry one them grind another no because he said the sheet are always there they will not grind it together so he prefer it when it's 
fresh like this so that you can take out the sheet and all that so i'm gonna be using this the fish yeah so that i can add more taste if it's in africa we use our dry fish and it will give you the real taste you want so here i have fresh pepper that is what i can see to buy here dry pepper uh, it's difficult for me to get the right taste for me so i decided to use one that will give me pepper because i like this, something that is very pepperish and this is a uh, yeah this is okay yeah i don't know if i'm getting it and here is anambra ede yes this is anambra ede that i'll be using to cook they have also i think they also have red red ede that one they use it for ofe ofe they use it to cook ofe oil yeah i'm from Igbo land and i'm from Imo states yeah, we are, we use red ede to cook ufo oil. And here is my bitter leaf. I asked him to buy fresh one, but he decided to buy this one because he told me that he doesn't have strength to squeeze it. So I bought this one because it's better you buy the fresh one and uh, squeeze it by yourself so that you know what you're eating. But anyway, he decided to buy this, but I haven't opened it. I will check it and see if it's actually because i bought this one from Ri Ibo man from nigeria he usually importing things from nigeria so um i believe it will be fine and here is my maggi maggi cube i'm gonna be using so guys join me while we prepare this delicacy of Olubu. yes so I'm gonna be adding the my spices now. Yeah, I'm gonna be adding because I need to steam the the meat and the fish together. Yeah, I have my turkey and the tilapia fish here on one pot. So I add my spice, my spices. Oh, this is it's too much. Uh, yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Here is the salt. I'm going to be adding my salt. I just pray this thing shouldn't be too much. Yeah, this is my salt. Is enough? Yeah. And uh, I'm going to be adding my muddy cube. I just want to season the, the meat a bit. I'm going to be adding my Maggi cube. Let me add my Maggi cube. Yeah. Add my Maggi cube. This is my Maggi cube. Then I'll put my onion. I'm gonna be adding my onion. Yeah, guys, this is my onion. I'm gonna be adding my onion. Yeah, add my onions. Then I leave it to boil. Ah. So I've already entered the knife. So I'm gonna leave it to be. 
then I will tell you guys how far it goes. Then I'll have to cut the uh, the kukuyam. Anambra kukuyam. Then I'll boil it and it's okay. I will have to pan it and put it on the soup so that it will take in the soup. Yeah, guys, I will see you soon. So I decided to put some pepper on it. Yeah, I decided to cut some little pepper on it so that it will have more taste. So I'm gonna be putting my pepper. I'm gonna be putting this pepper for it to have a very good taste. So guys, I'll be cutting the ede, the anambra ede. Yeah, I'm gonna be cutting it now. I'll peel it. Then I'll put it for you to boil as well. When it's done, I'm going to be pounding it. I'll pound it and um, put it so that it, it can help the soup to be thicken. This one thickens the soup. Yeah, guys, I finished cutting the um, the Anambra Ede, Kukuyam Ede. So, um, I'm going to be putting it inside the soup now. So that it will boil then when it's done i'm gonna pan it and put it this will help the soup to be thicken yes so when the soup when the the um the kokoyam white kokoyam is done i'll pan pan it and put it in here so that it will thicken the soup so guys you sit and be ready to enjoy this lovely meal with me yes because when i finish cooking this meal guys you need to enjoy it join me while i enjoy and enjoy my fruits while i prepare the delicacy see you soon so guys here is the kokoyam the anambra kokoyam i finished pounding it and here is the soup I'm going to be putting it inside this lovely soup. I have put my ogre. Ogre, ogre. And this is the tilapia fish. I finished boiling it. So I'm putting the kokoyam inside the soup. Man, you need to see how this kitchen is filled with aroma and the perfume of this soup. You guys are going to see the end of this soup. It's gonna be lovely and nice. Hmm. So wait and see the end of this soup, guys. So guys, I'm gonna cover this soup to boil so that this kokoyam will dissolve very well. Yeah. Cover it while it boils. So guys, here is the soup now. The ofo olugo. So I'm gonna be putting the olugo. See, it's thick now. See, very thick. Very very thick. Yeah. Hmm. No no it's okay. That's you go do the little mix so that I will know how it is. Yeah, this is it. See how thick it is. Yeah. Yeah. Olubu soup. Yeah, this is it. It's getting ready. Just more. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. This is the soup. Yeah. See? See how delicious and mende mende it is. See? 
think I need one more. Very delicious and mend the mend them. Put one cable magu. And that is it. Yeah. That is it. So guys, the bitter leaf soup is ready and here is my um pandan yam. I made this one as well. I'm gonna be using it too finish this my lovely vegetable soup that i prepare i'm gonna show you the soup now yeah here is the vegetable soup i mean the bitter leaf soup that i prepared so i'll be using it to mm, dilute this mendemende soup join me soon so guys here is the soup yeah i'm going to enjoy it with that my pandan yam now. Mm. Very lovely. Gonna be eating it so so guys so in my nest. But so that whenever I release any videos, you'll be the first person to subscribe. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. Bye.